Over the course of the last two seasons, the Hananiga girls basketball team has only lost one conference game. A program that just continues to churn out college athletes. We take a deeper look at one of them this week in our Spotlight segment. Meet Haley Warren. If you're in the stands for a Hananiga girls basketball game, it'll be hard to miss their outspoken senior, Haley Warren. I've always been pretty, pretty loud, you know, when I was younger. I stopped talking to Haley, stopped talking in classes and stuff. Probably more than anything, it's, it's unlimited energy. You know, that's, that's one of the things that she's got a lot of. You'll also notice her sniper-like scoring ability from beyond the arc. I want to compete, I want to win, I, if you're going to do it, go back your home, you know. She didn't start playing basketball until middle school, but by the time freshman year came around, head coach Jason Brunke felt she was ready to be moved up to varsity. She's really uh, transitioned from an athlete to a basketball player, you know, and that's kind of the biggest thing. She always um, had, you know, really, really good athleticism and traits and really has kind of blossomed into more than just a shooter as well and really become an all-around basketball player. Being a part of those teams, she got to develop under some former Indian greats like Jordan King, who currently plays at Marquette, and Julia Burns. Just the way she played and she was always into it and even if she was having an off day, she'd always come to practice and be like, okay, we got to get it done. And I think I really look up to her in a lot of different aspects. Haley also looks up to her parents, who both played collegiate athletics. Her mom, Tiffany, played soccer, and her dad, Jeremy, was a football and basketball star at Hananiga in the early 90s. He's since returned to coach for numerous schools around the state line. I'm very competitive, yes. Um, I think it would probably come from my mom and my dad. They definitely have always been very competitive. They have always pushed me to, like, want to be the best, do the best, and, like, anything I've done. They've always known how to push me. Like, I've always pressured myself, I think, but they've always known how to, like, make me go the extra mile. Like, how good do you really want to be? They've always said that. With sports being such a big part of their family, Haley's younger brother Cole is a sophomore at Hananiga and followed in his father's footsteps as a quarterback on the football field and guard on the basketball court. As you can imagine, the two siblings have shared quite a few battles over the years. We want to be one sometimes. Yeah, that gets really competitive. Uh, we're pretty evenly matched, though. So who's, who would you say is the better shooter between the two of you? I would say, I don't, oh, God. I might be a better shooter, but he definitely has ball handling. He, he can dribble. Oh, she's definitely the better shooter. I'm not even going to lie. She's definitely the better shooter. Yeah. Did, you, did you toughen him up at all? Uh, he would not like me saying yes, but I think so. I think, I think a little bit. Yeah. And that same competitive spirit she gets from her family, she tries to help uplift in her teammates. I feel my confidence has definitely grown a lot. I think I've, like, I personally like to be a leader for the team. I feel like I had to be confident in my skills and myself. And I think this year I'm finally like, okay, like, you know, you're a senior, you're a big kid on the team. With all the success the Hananiga girls basketball team has seen throughout her time in high school, Haley has certainly carved out a different path of the Warren family legacy. I think maybe I put a different spin on it. <laughs> I think I put a little spin on it because, you know, my, I think my dad, when he came here, he, for the basketball team at least, he was kind of more of like a passer. He was an amazing football player. But I think for, like, the basketball legacy, I want to, like, remember, like, you know, how far we went. If I was, like, outgoing, you know, a team leader, like, I just want to be that for our program. Well, you know, Scott, when you think about the all-time three-point grades, you got Steph Curry, Ray Allen, and obviously Haley Warren. Not a bad list. Yeah, I'd say so. She's certainly up there, and she'll continue to get even better at Lewis University next season.